What's up, everybody? This your boy Trayvon here with Scent Talk TV. Thank you so much for joining me here today. And as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my content. I really do appreciate the love and the support that you guys give. You guys are fantastic. You guys are dope. I'm very humble and grateful for everything that you guys do. With all the likes and comments, keep it up. I love that. But without further ado, let's jump into this review. So, my scent of the night, and also a fragrance that is discontinued. You might be able to find this on Fragrance X or Fragrance Net. Um, and eBay, if you find it on eBay, the prices is gonna be very high on this one. And it skyrocketed, like, overnight. Like, within a couple of days of people finding out that it's been discontinued and how great it is. Uh, it's a Paco Rabanne 1 million Franker flanker. And it is one million Privé. There's the bottle. You've got the size and concentration at the bottom. Uh, you have the size and concentration. Well, not the size. You got the concentration right here at the bottom here. Nothing too much going on with the back. The top. You got the one million. One million uh, logo at the top here and the front so I really do dig this bottle versus the original uh, 1 million bottle got the little brown uh, little texture brown color right here and the gold print uh, the atomizer is decent man this smells so good I am upset that they discontinued this. This is a great fragrance to be discontinued. I hate when they do that. They discontinued all the great stuff that sells. But I don't know if it's sold or they ran out of stock. I don't know. But this is fantastic, man. Um, What do I get out of this? I get a, a warm, spicy vanilla as well as a little bit of woody earthiness to it. It has patchouli in here, so I get it from there. In the opening, you have, in the opening, you have uh, mandarin orange, as well as, I believe it is, I'm not sure. But in the opening, I get a lot of uh, mandarin orange. Then in the mid, there's uh, tobacco. Is tobacco and then in the uh, the base, I think the base is um, I can't remember. Here's the notes right here. But uh, tobacco, patchouli, and mandarin orange is some of the notes in this fragrance, just to name a few. Uh, you all, oh, it's tonka bean in here also. Uh, I really get a lot of uh, tonka bean in the dry down of this fragrance. The, in the longevity of the fragrance, you get a nice, warm, spicy uh, tonka bean and vanilla. Um, the mandarin orange is kind of not prominent inside the dry down as the um, hours goes on with this fragrance, but it's hidden in the back. It's not in your face like it is in the opening. You know, it kind of lingers in the open, then it fades down and take the back seat. Then after that, that tobacco and the patchouli, the woodiness starts to come in and it starts to take over and linger throughout the dry down of the fragrance, which creates this warm vanilla, slight, slight fruity from the mandarin orange and it's boozy at the same time. Uh, this does not smell like the original um, One Million. You know, uh, it doesn't, it strays away and does its own thing. It does have that sweetness of one million, but it's not harsh. It's not in your face. It's not super sweet. It's a chill, common, you know, dialed down one million, but with a nice, warm, spicy vanilla whiskey note. And it which gives that balsamic uh, vibe from this. I enjoy this so much. Uh, longevity, I got a nice eight plus hours off my scan. It projects greatly around the 
hour, maybe a little bit over an hour mark. Then it sits closer to the skin, giving you that nice, warm, smooth, um, vanilla and sweet vibe in a centrale and a bubble around you. I did get a compliment from this at work. My uh, co-worker, she liked it. Um, uh, it's like, it's not a beast. Don't expect uh, just like an enormous beast of a fragrance out of this. You can get that beast mode out of this if you overspray this. But uh, if that's what you're looking for, feel free to do so. Um, but make sure you don't choke nobody out. I don't think this will choke anybody. I mean, I oversprayed this on me. In my experience, I oversprayed, and I didn't get the, uh, I didn't get any negative feedback saying that I was too loud. But uh, it's a story behind this. Um, I actually, like last year around the holiday season, um, I was uh, introduced to One Million Lucky, and I liked that fragrance. But next to it was Privé. I was gonna write this off, and I just looked at the box like, eh. but I smelled it. I smelled it, and it just blew my brains to smithereens versus the one million lucky and i was caught in a bit of a budget and i can only get one but i couldn't just help myself i love both of them so i went ahead and grabbed both and i am so freaking happy that i bought this one because it's discontinued and it's getting harder and harder to find and harder to obtain and i am so grateful that i got this uh a 3.4 100 milliliter size bottle and uh i remember coming in because i wanted to get a backup bottle of this and then i came back into my local macy's and it was gone i didn't see it no more and i went to dealers i went to any pretty much any retail uh store i could uh go into to see if i could find nordstrom they did not have this anymore i looked online they had it online but i procrastinated getting this and then before you know it it was it was gone um i knew this was discontinued before it even hit the fragrance from fragrance community in terms of everybody knowing that it's discontinued i knew that a long time ago but when i first started hearing the hype about you know everybody trying to jump on this i'm just so grateful that i got this and i didn't pass it up because this is gorgeous i got a compliment um at curbside pickup uh, I was uh, I ordered a pizza and um I had the uh, windows up and a heat blasting in the winter time and the girl that brought the pizza out I rolled I, ra I raised the window down uh I put the window down I went and uh, grabbed the pizza and then the heat that was blasting on me it came out of the window. And she immediately asked me, and she was like, what is that you're wearing? What is that you're wearing? I told her, she said, that smells so good. So this is a good complimenting fragrance. You will get compliments. This is a good date night fragrance. Uh, fall, winter time, maybe early spring. But this has a lot of dark and darkness and depth to it, which gives off a fall and winter time vibe. Uh, it's not very bright. It's very... Uh, it has a nice little uh, sexy sensual uh sensual uh seductive type of vibe coming from this one to the point where it's like a it could be a nice cuddle scent um but if you want to do that don't spray too much this um is a definitely a good fall and winter scent this is going to be one of my top five um to wear in the fall if you find this for a good price pick it up you know any discount stores, discount websites, you know, if you find a good price for it, pick it up. Um, yeah, man, like this is this is nice. Uh, one million prepay. Uh, age group, any age group can pull this bad boy off. Uh, I think you know, teenagers will appreciate it because it does have that sweetness to it. You know, it has that usefulness to it. Uh, you know, from that point on up to older gentlemen, that can, uh, any age group can pull this off. Um, you know, wear what you want to wear. If you like it, wear it. And I guarantee you, you'll like this one. I haven't got any negative feedback as far as compliments. You know, people in the fragrance community, 
uh, giving this any uh, negative feedback. I haven't seen any. Probably a few, but you know, the good outweighs the bad. So that's a, that's important. This right here, fantastic. If you can find it, pick it up. Don't hesitate. Don't hesitate. I really do enjoy this. Um, One million prepay discontinued, sadly. Yep. So that's all that I have for today for One Million Prepay, ladies and gentlemen. So as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my content. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Trayvon here at Scent Talk TV, and I will see you in the next video.